During this presentation, I'm going to demonstrate how you can sync between iThoughts and Omni Outliner. So if we open up iThoughts and create a quick map, call it Omni, and we'll create uh, a new child topic, idea one, then idea two, and idea three. And then under idea three, we'll uh, create some more subtopics, just idea, idea, and idea. Then we'll um, uh, select idea one and then open up the um, notes window once we've tidied up the map. So if we open up the notes window and then enter a note against idea one. Then if we select idea two and we'll assign uh, a web link to that. So www.ithoughts.co.uk Then what we're going to do is save this up to Dropbox. So if we make sure that the OPML format is enabled, this is what Omni Outliner can read, and then we'll go send to Dropbox in OPML format, and we'll save it in our shared folder. Okay, so that's exported and uploaded to Dropbox. If we now open up our Dropbox folder in uh, Omni Outliner, there we can see the file omni.opml. If we open that, there we have Omni Outliner has opened up uh, that map as an outline. So we can see the, the notes field there, and we can see the web link and idea one, two, and three. Uh, if we now add an idea four in uh, Omni Outliner and then save that, that will save back up to Dropbox. Now we can go back to iThoughts and select to re-download from Dropbox. So if we re-download that OPML file, that will download it and open it in iThoughts. And here we can see that's now pulled in idea four. So that demonstrates how you can use Omni Outliner and iThoughts together with Dropbox to uh, sync up your ideas. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoy using iThoughts. Thank you.